So in this example, I have a PDF file open in Adobe Acrobat. It's 38 pages in length. And if you go to the left-hand side here, you're going to notice there's an option called bookmarks. When I click on it, inside of the PDF file, we have bookmarks that indicate various pages inside the document. So when we click on them, it takes us right to those pages. With Fiery Job Master, we can utilize these bookmarks to insert tabs into our document in the proper spots. Let me show you how we do this. So we'll right click on the file inside of uh, Command Workstation, select Job Master. This will open up Job Master window. On the left hand side is our page view, which is nothing more than the PDF file. The center is the sheet view showing how it's going to look once we print the file. So the next thing we do is select Action, Chapter and Bookmark Actions and then Insert Tab and then select the Bookmark Level 1. And now with the Edit Tab window open you're going to see that all the tab ears have the bookmark names put on them and they've been inserted in the document in the proper place. We also have other controls for the tab text. We can change the font, the font size, we can make it bold, we can make it a different color. In this case, let's make it bold. And uh, let's actually add an image to the tab here, so we can do that as well with Job Master. We'll click on that, we add a fiery logo. It's a little big, so we'll come down here and scale it down a little bit to, to about 70% or so. And we do have other options here. We could rotate it if we wanted to, change the margin, and so on and so forth. But if we like what we have, we hit apply to all styles, hit apply, and you're going to see the properties of the tab ears are now all the same. So now let's click OK, and we'll go up to the zoom button in Job Master to zoom in on the pages to look at our finished results. So as you notice, as we scroll down, each of the tabs are now before each of the chapters where they should be, all based off the bookmarks inside of the PDF file.